Hi guys, welcome back to Estella Wilson Creations. Today we will be going to the Dollar Tree. Can't wait to show you all the new items they had. And then I'll show you what I actually brought home. Um, and this was like a day, date, day. We did go to Chili's and I'll show you some pictures. Um, we don't really eat at Chili's a lot. Actually, I've only had it maybe two or three times. I am definitely an Applebee's person. I really love my buffalo wings, my steak, my burgers there. I mean, Applebee's is just amazing in our town. But this time, we tried um, chilies, and I got the fajitas, and, um, they were amazing, so, um, I just hope you guys enjoy hanging out with me, and, um, going through the Dollar Tree, and just following my day, so let's just get into this haul, the first item that I found at the Dollar Tree was these planters, now this guy's name is Tyson, they have Roscoe, they have Norris, um, and I think it's one other one, but these are the two that I saw that I didn't pick up, so I wanted to share with you. Tyson, I don't know, is he a dinosaur or some sort, but he's purple, and I just don't, I don't have any kids, no boys, and I don't see, that's not really a thing that I would gravitate towards, so I left him at the store. So here's Norris up close and personal now. He's okay. I guess he's a Norwal. And then they have these new little jars. I almost got the rooster. And tons and tons of Halloween things. I actually got the orange bucket. And I also got the little orange trick or treat as well. Guess I'm feeling orange this year. Um, I just wanted to show you guys everything they had. Those cops colanders which is things they had those last year and this year day of the dead made a return to the dt if you like them like um sugar skulls and things like that i really really think this year was the best year i've seen they have like in a whole in cap of stuff um i do want to let you know if you don't really understand day of the dead i suggest that you see the movie coco i didn't see that to years after it was out but it helped me understand a little Little bit more about the Mexican culture and why it's so important to them why it's so important to them and uh, why they celebrated I really felt like I connected to that movie and it gave me a clear understanding of what was going on and at least me I work with a lot of um, Mexican people um, and they would talk about it and I never understood like why they loved it so much but to appreciate your loved ones um and celebrate them is just um uh, is a good thing so um let's get into all of the day of the day items that they had they had so many of them here they go they had candles two different kinds uh, they had all of these plates. Now, these were shaped as a school, but they also had some circle ones that I showed you in the beginning. All of these signs so you can put your yard. And then these are the items that I picked up. I got these glass pumpkins. I got them in like the orange and the moss color. I did get a bowl for my dog. She needed a new one. Um, she goes through these like nobody's business. I did pick up some um, ribbon. These are the two that I didn't have that I thought were pretty. I really like that burnt orange color and that moss green. See my theme for this fall? I did get some toothbrushes. Um, I didn't even realize that I had picked these up. Um, in another video, I got more of these. So at this point, I know I like them, but when I first got those two, I didn't know. I got some orange picks, and I finally found the famous farmer market calendar, and yes, I did get two of them, one to keep as a calendar, and then one to DIY, cannot wait to tear this one up. I got a Sharpie marker because I was looking for one um, when I was trying to write on something. And then from Home home Goods, I found this coffee container. So I wanted to throw that in there as well. Oh, baby, feel free. Oh, 
So I'm going to put all our coffee in there. I'm adding to my collection little by little. It's pretty big. So I was happy with this little haul. And then I forgot I didn't run over to Ross. I got these books for $1.99. So I wanted to share that as well. These are some paper clips. I believe that's a sloth. You guys let me know if you know what that is. But it looks like a sloth to me. So I got two of those. And then I got this Bible journaling book that one of my members of a Facebook group told us about uh, Victoria um, found these. And I was like, I could really benefit from those. So then, of course, I was on the hunt, $1.99 for a Bible journaling book. Like, yes. So I cannot wait to read that and do the exercises. So we are headed to Chili's now. I wanted to show you the skies. Look how dark they had got. Um, yeah, I just like looking at the skies. Um, but this particular day, the skies were gloomy. But we are headed to Chili's. I'm going to see you when we get there. Just watch me break in your sweat. You're falling into me, touch me. I swear. You're a dog. Alright. One for me. Alright. We're having a day date at Chili's. Uh, not the norm for us. And we're off to win our bath until our food comes. And my niece is here, but she wants to pretend she isn't. See that, guys? Look what she's doing. Oh, she took her mask off, too. Give her two thumbs down. So life is stressful, guys. Just try to bring some normalcy to our life. And one of the things I love is going to Dollar Tree and then just getting out on my days off. We only eat out maybe once a week. Um, sometimes three or four times a month, but not that often, but we did go to Chili's. I got the fajitas, and these are all the sides they gave you. Avocado, pingo de gallo. The pingo de gallo here was really, really good. It was spicy. I wish I would have got a lot more of that. The salsa was good. Um, it was amazing. I actually like the steak a little bit better than the chicken, but a balance is, you know, needed. So I would get this again. They end up giving me flour tortillas, which I like corn tortillas, but I didn't want to send them back, so I just ate the flour ones. I don't hate the flour ones. I just prefer corn now. So, yeah, but didn't this look amazing? So, yeah, yeah, yeah. Good food, good food, good food. So, my sister got, like, this chicken beans bowl. Um, it looked really good, and she actually ate almost all of it. She said that she would order it again. I love the presentation. I really think they garnished it nicely. Um, and yeah, we were all full. That's the number one thing I like. If you're gonna go in a restaurant, I need to go to somewhere where I'm full at the end. I cannot spend 30 to 50 dollars on food and then I'm like, I'm hungry still. Like, no. So Chili's didn't disappoint in that department and the presentation of their food was spot on. Okay, guys, I got a few more. My husband decided to get this, and the picture looked like a lot more. To be honest, it wasn't filling for him. He was eating off my plate a lot, um, but you did get corn, a piece of bread, some pickles, some sausage, some ribs, and this little bitty um, 
thing of fries but for him it wasn't enough my husband does eat a lot so he said it tasted good it just wasn't filling it looked like you get a lot but not really and he didn't eat the bread he really don't eat bread so i guess that would have felt up some of the spot because you guys know bread is thick but i don't know it looked it good but not enough for him so there you go at his take so the last one for today my niece got this um it is um, like a mac and cheese with penny noodles with some chicken on it. She didn't really like it. She said it was blame. Um, my niece doesn't eat them a lot, so this is actually off the kids' meal side. And it came with a piece of corn. She ate the corn, I believe. Um, and then she ate some of my food as well. So everyone really loved the fajitas that I got that day. Um, but yeah, that is going to be it for this video, guys. I really hope you guys enjoyed shopping with me. And seeing what they had at Chili's. I would love to know in the comments below. Are you a Chili's person? Do you go to Chili's? And what do you get on the menu? Because my husband said he wants to start adding this to our rotation. Because he really liked it, my food. So he wants to try that the next time we go back. That's going to be it for this video guys. Thanks so much for watching. I'll see you next time.